Yeah, I thought I had a bottle of yikes. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, this is your boy Jake Fever, and I've been having this funny feeling about Uncle Nearest. And I think the flavor has actually changed in one of my favorite whiskeys. And I'm going to figure this out. So, put these bottles up to show you. And let's taste them. Now, I got my communion cups right here. It's not really like a full shot. But... Let me tell you, man. I've been tasting something a little different in these new blends right here. Tastes got like a, a little funny, little a more sour mash taste to me. And I'm ready to get to the bottom of this. Now, I got the old school um, Uncle Nears, like the old bottles. If you don't, if you don't know, like the new bottles, they come with this little this little horseshoe. And the old bottles, they have these little things right here. Like the old, like slavery uh, house on there or something like that. But that's besides here or there. I'm trying to get to the bottom of the flavor of these things. So the flavor profile has been off. I know they have uh, actually changed their uh, their whiskey inside. They used to use somebody else's whiskey, I think MPG or something like that. Or I think that's what they call it. But now they um, open it up and barrel aging their own whiskey. So... I gotta get to the bottom of this. So this just is a brief, quick taste test, and I'm, I'm just thinking something's up. I don't like. I don't think I like the new flavor as much. Now this is my favorite one, so I'm gonna taste this one first, just to just to give it a baseline. This the 1884. This one here is so delicious. Baseline taste, small batch, 1884, 93 proof. Okay, okay. I'm liking that one. I'm liking that one. And then this is the original. We'll go with the original real quick. See, it got like a, a more. I don't know. I don't know. I'm. I'm guessing that since these are stronger. Like, let me see. This is 63% alcohol by volume. It's a single barrel. Shit is strong. And this is 100 proof. So let's go with the rye. Now, the rye's supposed to give it a little more heat, different flavor profile, but a lot of my friends say they're liking this a lot more. So I'm just tasting it again just to, just to make sure that I'm not tripping. That rye is off. I don't like the. I, th I don't think I like the rye that's in it. I don't think I like the rye that's in it. Single barrel. Let's go to single barrel. The single barrel, right? It's a much more pronounced flavor profile. I think the old school ones I like the most because I don't like the rye in it. And the single barrel is really potent, but it's got a strong strength flavor profile, which each barrel will taste different because the single barrel. Um, this one came out a little strong and and really oaky and like you feel it tastes like the nuttiness and woodiness of of the barrel. I think I was just tripping. I think mixing this in, with some ice and diluting this a little bit more will make this taste more like this profile. So yeah, I'm tripping. I think uh, Uncle Nearest is doing their thing. I'm sorry, I got to keep getting down, man. I was just thinking about this. It was on my mind, so I wanted to just go ahead and review it real quick. Had my communion cup, so hey, thanks for sticking around for this video. Appreciate you. Yes, sir.